Hey guys, this is Gabriel with the Elite Auto Spa. Today we're coming with some content regarding the IK sprayers and impressos that I have in the back. This is the IK sprayer that I've ordered from the right company and I've been using it for about three months now. I really love them. I like that the way that the bottle fills, it's a really industrial grade, right? It has a canyon head. The one thing that I don't like about it is that the shape of the spray head it kind of digs into your skin when you're doing multiple repetition type of uh, cleanings when you're trying to spray upwards. Sometimes it stops spraying if there's not that much fluid in. If it sprays downwards, it's not gonna um, also spray as well. Sometimes if it's kind of empty. The one thing that I wish it did have was a dual action pump handle. Um, also too, this spray head, because it's small, it makes it feel like it's bottom heavy, not not even when you're trying to spray or go around in, in a circle. So that's just one of the things that I've been seeing while detail, detailing in three months that I've been using this uh, sprayer. The one thing that I do want to show you is the Pressel. So Pressel is 750 mils. It's also an industrial grade spray head, dual action. It feels nice and light, nice and even, right? It also has, if I want to spray upward, it's gonna still collect the fluid because there's a little metal weight in there that's gonna allow me to still spray. And if I'm gonna spray down, it's gonna it's gonna go shift back to the, to the downward action. So it'll still spray. The one thing I do like is from Obsessed Garage, he, I know he's been talking about this for a couple of years that he's trying to get a nice spray head, nice label, and have them nicely shown in this garage, you know, so you don't have to worry about getting something else. So the one thing I do like is the, the actual label I've been using for three weeks. Um, it hasn't peeled back on me, and I've been using different kind of chemicals, so which is a plus. So one of the things that I do like is I can have them all labeled, I can fill them up with whatever I want, and they already have a label on them, so which is a plus. The one thing I do want to touch bases on is the IK sprayers with the modified um, Pressol standard, not industrial spray head. It makes it nice and even weighted because it's a kind of a bigger spray head. It also has a dual action and. I'm able to still, if I if I really wanted to, maybe it'll go spray up, maybe it won't, but I mean, that's just how it is because it doesn't have weight in the bottom. But as far as like everything, if you modify this, the, the black piece, then you can tighten these down and they're not gonna leak. Or if you just crank them down, you know, this one's not modified, but this one is not leaking at all. If you have that problem, what I found was, I can just go simply as taking this apart, right? So taking it apart. Um, and then here, I wanna show you that you can shave this lip down. And then um, once you're done, you, you basically pop it back on, right? So pop it back on, grab the spray head. And then from there, you can just tighten them down and it's not gonna leak. So simple as that. You just do it like that and it won't leak. Hey guys, thank you for watching this video. Um, hopefully this content was very helpful. I know there was a lot of people out there saying, hey, how can we modify this IK sprayer with a different head? So um, little things like that, maybe this video will be helpful for you guys. Uh, I'm gonna try to make some more videos for you guys as far as like clean the rims, you know, properly dressing the tires, to washing a vehicle, to interior cleaning, to just, you know, whatever you guys want to learn. So uh, let me know in the comments below and uh, we'll go from there. Well, thank you very much and I'll see you on the next one.